टू थर्ड ऑफ आर बॉडी इज मेड अप ऑफ वॉटर सो फॉर द प्रॉपर फंक्शनिंग ऑफ द ऑर्गन एडिकुएट वॉटर इज एसेंशियल हाउ एवर द सेम वॉटर वेन कंज्यूम्ड इन अ रॉन्ग वे बिकम्स द रीजन फॉर मोस्ट शॉकिंग हेल्थ प्रॉब्लम लाइक माइग्रेन जॉइंट पेन वीक डाइजेशन स्किन प्रॉब्लम्स हेयर फॉल लेथार्जी हार्ट एंड किडनी प्रॉब्लम्स द सैड पार्ट इज दैट नाइन्टी नाइन परसेंट ऑफ द पीपल ड्रिंक वॉटर इन अ रॉन्ग वे ड्यू टू विच दे आर अन इंटेंशनली हार्मिंग देयर बॉडी रादर दैन गेटिंग बेनिफिट फ्रॉम दिस मेराकुलस ड्रिंक सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू नो द राइट वे ऑफ ड्रिंकिंग वॉटर स्टे ट्यून्ड Hello friends welcome to Fit Tuber. Water is most important for our body. Without water we can't use the nutrients that come from carbs, proteins and fats. Because water is so essential and beneficial it does not mean that we can drink water whenever we want to. In this video I will share with you five reasons that you are drinking water the wrong way and the ways to fix it. Watching this video till the end you will have a clear idea as to what when and how to drink water so that it works for you and not against you. Starting with number 5 drinking water before and after meals. Gulping a glass of water after meals might be the most satisfying thing for you. However, this is the worst thing that you can do to your body. When we eat a meal our body's temperature rises for better digestion. But drinking water just after meals instantly dilutes the gastric juices reducing the body's ability to digest food this way the food doesn't get digested properly and rots within the system and when food rots within the system not only your body fails to absorb the nutrients from it but also it brings along digestive problems like bloating gas acidity etc this is the reason you see people saying that i eat mostly healthy food but i'm still not able to get the desired results i'm not able to lose weight even though i'm drinking enough water the reason is that you are drinking water just before or after meals one small hack that i practice is that instead of drinking water i rinse my mouth with it it really helps number 4 gulping down the water in today's fast paced life most people mindlessly drink water it might seem hard to believe but in reality the way water enters your body can make a huge difference if you drink water too fast anyway your body won't accept it and would flush most of it out exactly the opposite of what you wanted to happen moreover our stomach is acidic in nature on the other hand saliva in our mouth is alkaline in nature and its job is to stabilize the acid in stomach when we gulp a large amount of water at once very less saliva gets mixed with the water so the atmosphere inside the stomach remains acidic this may cause acidity indigestion bloating gas etc even gain in weight because stomach fails to absorb the nutrients from the food and remove the unwanted material from the body ideally one should slowly sip the water to start with you can avoid bottles with wide mouth or even better to use a glass or sip Number 3 drinking chilled water. Do you after coming back from office run to the refrigerator grabbing a bottle of chilled water to quench your thirst? If yes then you better stop doing that. Drinking chilled water can not only cause a sore throat but also has serious demerits. Firstly cold water shrinks the blood vessels seriously restricting the digestion process. Chilled water also tend to solidify the fats from the food making it tough for your body to break down the unwanted fats. Another major side effect of drinking cold water is joint pains. Not only this, there are many studies proving today that chilled water decreases the heart rate. Ideally, one should drink water at room temperature. Lukewarm water is even better. Although if at all you want to drink cold water, start using earthen pots. Not only are they natural water cooler but also balance the pH of water removing the impurities. Number 2 drinking too much water. I have come across people who forcefully drink water throughout the day even when they are not thirsty just because somebody told them that more water means more benefits of course proper hydration is important but excess of anything is bad and this holds true for water also drinking water in excess makes the salts and other electrolytes in our body too diluted and one of sodium's jobs is to balance the fluid in and around your cells drinking too much water causes an imbalance and the liquid moves from blood to inside your cells making them swell and in 
case of brain cells, that's seriously bad news. Having yellowish urine and parched lips are some of the signals given by the body that you are dehydrated. The number one reason that you are drinking water the wrong way is that you are drinking it while standing. Another side effect of fast-paced lives is that today people drink water not just standing but walking or even while running. When we drink water in standing position, our kidneys are not able to filter the water properly. Moreover, in this position, your muscles and nervous system are not relaxed and it makes difficult for your nerves to quickly digest the fluid. This may disrupt the balance of fluids in the body, leading to greater accumulation of fluids in the joints, thus triggering arthritis. So it is best to sit down and sip water slowly. So these were some of the most common mistakes that people do while drinking water. Let us now see when, how much and in which utensil you should drink water. When to drink water. Whenever you feel thirsty, drink water. However, one time when water should never be skipped is just after waking up. We have already discussed how saliva helps in neutralizing the stomach acid and the morning saliva is considered to be most effective. So so every morning before brushing your teeth, drink water. Water can also be consumed in between the meals and not with meals. Keep a gap of at least one hour after the meals and 30 minutes before the meals. How much water to drink? How much water a person needs in a day depends on many factors like individual's body type, weight, physical activity and climate. Our body also gets water from various foods like fruits and vegetables. So it would be unfair to give one fixed quantity. It is best to see how your body responds and drink accordingly. Generally speaking, 2.5 to 3 liters per day is good enough. In which utensil should we drink water? Water can be consumed from any utensil. However, if you drink water from a copper vessel, the benefits get multiplied. It is recommended to store water in a copper vessel a night before keep it near you preferably on a wooden surface and have this water first thing in the morning. Make sure you drink from the copper vessel itself and not transfer it into any other metal container. Drink this copper charged water for just 3 months and you will be amazed to see what it does to your body. Water is life, it is panacea for many health problems. All we need to do is drink it the right way. That's all for this video, I hope you found it to be helpful. If yes then please show me your support by giving this video a big thumbs up. Would you want to know the rules of eating curd? Let me know. Which one of these mistakes were you making the most? Comment below. Please do remember to subscribe to my channel, hit that bell icon so that you never miss a video from me. Are you on Instagram? You can follow me there for daily health tips. My name is Vivek. I thank you so much for watching.